I'm Lawson with Ampere EV, and today I'm going to talk to you about junction boxes. So the junction box is a product that we sell as a part of our Atom Drive system that we're really proud of. We spent a lot of time developing this to be a really compact package. Now, if you're familiar with junction boxes, you know the effort that goes into them. But if you're not, I'm going to walk you through how they function and what's inside them. So inside of a junction box, it's kind of your gateway to controlling the high voltage system. So it takes the power from your battery and it sends it to all of your high voltage systems, whether it's your electric motor, maybe it's an AC compressor, maybe it's a water heater. This is how you get the power from the battery to everything else. And it's important that you do it in a very controlled manner. So inside this junction box, we have a contactor. And so what a contactor is, essentially a really large relay. So instead of switching a 12 volt power, this is able to connect and disconnect a 400 volt battery pack. It can also flow 350 amps, so it's a really high power relay. We also have an assortment of fuses here that we spec correctly in our junction box. So these fuses are much bigger than your standard automotive 12 volt fuses. This can be a 400 amp fuse. And so we spec these and select the best components within our junction box. We also have a pre-charge and a discharge circuit within the junction box. The pre-charge circuit is to start up the high voltage system. And you have to do that slowly. If you connect it immediately, there are capacitors in the system that'll cause an inrush of current that can be thousands of amps. So instead we use this circuit to do this slowly and then bring the system up in a controlled fashion. Same for the discharge. When you turn off your car, you wanna make sure there's no voltage on any of the high voltage circuits in case you're gonna work on it, right? We discharge the circuit every time you turn off the car so that there's no power sort of lingering in any capacitors within the system. And then finally, we have all of our connections on the junction box. So on our box, we have one input from the battery and we have one large output for the electric motor. We also have smaller high voltage outputs, which are how you connect each of your accessories. And we show you on the lid here how each one is fused so that you can make sure that you are connecting the appropriate component. So if you haven't built a junction box yet, one of the really hard things about it is specking all of these components appropriately to work together. It's important that the fuses are the right size and that all of your electrical connections are going to the right place. And here at Ampere EV, we do that for you. So we have taken all of this and put it into a nice tidy package with the best components available on the market. So it's plug and play for your EV conversion. Please like and subscribe and watch all of our other, <laughs> that's the hardest part, man. And don't forget to check out our other videos. We have a lot of great content on EV conversions and the Atom Drive system.